In this video, I will demonstrate how Kabam can identify and measure all the phrases or words that shouldn't be there. Phrases like to be defined or unknown. It could also be used to positively validate those phrases that should exist in a field. For example, an invoice number should start with an INV, so we can use this pattern to test for that as well. Why do we do this? Well, illegal phrases might interfere with the logic in the application or another application relying on this data, or the data might indicate that the record is incomplete. So let's have a look at a scenario. I've got a customer master record in a form, and the customer name has got unknown traders in it. Unknown we don't want. And also, if you look at the next field, customer type TBD to be defined, also an illegal phrase or character. So Kabam will hunt these down and will record them as an anomaly. So let's have a look at this in a little bit more detail. I've got a customer master in front of me and then column B customer name. And you'll notice the first record is called unknown cycles. Well, I'm not happy with that. So I want to set up a Kabam test that finds unknown cycles. So I go into the web application, I create a test customer name can't be unknown. And I will tell Kabam to look at the customer name field. And then I will tell it which phrases I'm not happy to have. Unknown is one of them. And I'll save that. And then we we'll go through to the dashboard. We're going to go through quote to cash, sell, uh, closing contract. And there we have it down at the bottom. Customer name can't be unknown. I've got 10 tested records. And guess what? The one that has failed in the details file is unknown cycles, which you can clearly see in the details.